I haven't been able to fig figure out what that was in. Like, was it Cusco? Was it? Oh, like, was it? The, it wouldn't be the movie. It must have been one of the shows, one of the episodes. But what one? You know? I've tried my best to look it up, but I can't find it. If anyone knows, please let me know. Because, you know, it's a great line. Let's check down here. This place is still virgin territory, so, uh. Some supplies in here. Oh, and this person is down here too. Didn't even notice. The life support deck provides most house critical functions: power, air, and water treatment f facilities. But if only one would prove of these would prove catastrophic. And some water often used as coolant for stuff. Mm. Probably have something else, but still. I'm sure something would explode. Silks. Do not share with Weber O six forty three. Sup. Guten Tag. You know you got a weird horror game when the player ends up running at the enemy and just starts beating the shit out of them. I think all bits of the enemy fell down below. No, here's some. Hiya. Oh, yeah. Thank you for coming closer. Ooh, nearly dead. Um. Uh, Easily, easily solved. Hmm. Move that in a second. Whoa. You know what? Have some fun. Of course, not dead, not dead at all. One, yep. Again, another way to get this that same thing again. The Neural Horizon Tree, epilogue of Brady's story, case studies of Neuromod donors and recipients. Once to visit the Graces, Brady passed from our par uh, paraplexus, and the connect home of her ability to skate still remains unused and transfer our data banks. Her, her parents just declined to be interviewed, citing the interviews with Brady had done more harm than good. Rather than raising awareness of the condition, it had shown the division. Brady had been one of the first to recover her new handicap. But Neuromods are the future. What happens to those unable to use them, or afford them? Requesting new operator. Well, obviously they're left behind and buddy buddy but That is creepy. It's like a spider. Don't forget to complete a patient questionnaire. Your feedback will be invaluable. Sure. Are you... Uh. I wonder if it's possible for me to find people by just, you know, proximity to them here. Hmm. It's not something I can open. 
Maybe the other side. And you like, basically forget, never get to loot them, but if they're considered found. Like this guy. Psych. Psycho art particle injector? Team, talk to me. We've had enemy contact, but the enemy. They should have held position in the cargo bay. I couldn't, Chief. I couldn't let those people. Can you get to the escape pods? Negative. The escape pods are malfunctioning. It's like they're locked in place. Only four of us made it to life support. Five. I'm picking up Remmer behind you. Negative. Remmer... Remmer isn't Remmer, Chief. These... things. Chief, the main lift. It isn't working. We're locked out. Oh my god. Remmer. Remmer's here. Stay away. Teague. Stay away. Teague. Erica. Respond. Mm-hmm. Tobias Frost. Why do you have their recording? Okay. Su suicide via glue gun, I suppose. Stash in the hall by the skate pods. No time to ri rig a drop. Good luck. To have ho to whoever finds this. And west the tall. Nice and easy in um, Team Revolution and uh, Mankind Divided. Know if you read something or not, because you get the prompt saying, "Oh, here, here's some XP." In the hall by the escape pods. Okay, if you're hearing weird little noises out of me, it's just because I'm seeing things, um... Uh, like, I've gone through a horror situation. Sometimes I remember random things, just, they just start flashing before my eyes, and... It's an anxiety thing. It's, it's not even that traumatic. Sometimes it's just fucking porn. But it's still just, again, things flashing before your eyes. It doesn't matter what it is. An uncomfortable tang, typically. Cargo bay, so that's how you get there. Penny Thompson. I will repair you, true to goo. But anyway, uh, service. Thankfully, they didn't put in the good class. Two people have checked out this equipment and failed to return it. Ari Uthair and Roger Muir. Equipment requests. Consider this friendly reminder that you still have to, uh, department equipment checked out. It's supposed to be returned at the end of your last shift, even if you tend to check it out again. And just keep it until you're done. I know it's a pain, but that's a process. I'm going to check that stuff today. Funds will automatically apply to your next pay scale. Goo gun and spare parts. Joe's annual maintenance coming up soon on the air mo uh, mixture regulators in the atmosphere. A Max know about getting a head start. He has a fabrication plan for them. Is that something we can deal with? Oh, super repair fabricated fabricator thing. Normally I'm fine on the little panics thing, but sometimes some days are worse than others. I remember one when I was getting dealing with new medication, and it was oh god, that that was painful. It was when I was recording Eridor, um, some of the later episodes of it, um, mid to late. Um, you may notice me being off in those, or maybe not. Maybe I held it together well enough. Hmm. 
Hmm. Anyway, I found a little hatch here. Or opening. But any any relevancy. No. I'm just gonna have to send myself. I need to use the lift. Who wants some? You looking at me? You existing in me? Oh, you have got nothing? Thank you. Storage room. ever get to review Prey? I think he did. Or at least it was released when he was alive. They did actually hit the wrong key when I was in the circle and it didn't, it just moved him. Maybe it was because it was a movement key. But I was figuring a failure attempt if you did anything but the right key. stuff in there, but I need to find a scrapper. A recycler. Why do they have Q-beam cells, anyway? They don't use that. There's the power plant. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah, I hacked my way in there. Escape pods down here. Ah, Remmer's still here. Good morrow, gents. Hmm? The door's been locked behind me. No, oh, no, no, I just closed. Ow. I feel the jellied eels is a dishonored knot. Because that's a, one of the biggest food items in the game, and then they've developed. It's made this made by the same company. How they even had like one of the same artists working on this game. You've seen it in the poster. Uh, are they meet you family ten?
Guten Tag. Haha. Phantom scared. So unhelped. Again, it feels like a funny horror game when, you know, the monster is just cowering. You wanted to speak to me? Yes, I'd like to arrange a time to oversee installation of a special particle injector in the water treatment facility. Hang on, you want me to do what now? I've already confirmed the inlet and outlet fittings are to spec. And just what precisely is this thing supposed to inject into our water supply? I'm not at liberty to say. Uh-huh. Well, then, we have a problem, Tobias. Dr. Kelstrup has already seen and approved. I'm gonna need to see a signature from Alex or Morgan or something like that. But, so, until I see ink on the dotted line, you'll just have to keep showing your special injector to Dr. Kelstrup. Psychic water. Alika, this is Kirk Rimmer. We're in escape pod 89. Everyone is secured, but the launch controls aren't responding. Did you follow all the steps on the launch card exactly? Yeah, the klaxon even sounded, but the hatch won't close. We can't separate. Hang on. I'm looking at the schematics. There should be a remote sensor on the explosive bolts. Alika, please, hurry. I see all the leads, but wait. This can't be right. Can you launch us from there? Can you at least close the goddamn hatch? Uh, no, I don't think so. Is there a manual crank of some sort? Remmer. Remmer, do you copy? Mm. Oh, well. Reactivator. I would reduce side cost to telepathic powers, reduce cooldown. Alright. Currently it's mimicking the roof. Good for it. Can't lose it, sadly. It's, you know, we're always stuck. Let's not use that escape pod. Then we use Psy abilities, so Psy hypo. That's unnerving. Psy Hubbos are basically just resource caches. Great. This is honestly scaring me.
Hmm, not too many rounds left. Just about dry. Um, maybe we can do a pistol. Are you angry? No. No, not yet. I'm not too worried about ambushes by the other mi by mimics. You know, this is one pretty extreme episode of Undercover Boss. Like, my god. What's up? Hmm. Didn't do too much damage. Sort of enemy. I suppose as long as we're not eating them. <laughs> 